250 supercar, five speed, 130 odd mile an hour top speed, 0 to 60 in about 2.5, three seconds. Power to weight ratio for about 500 brake horse per ton. The cost for a season's race of the MSA Championships is six to 8,000 maximum, depending on like if you do any damage to the year and things like that. The comparison to one of these is uh, with faster than British touring cars, for instance, so you look at the budget they're spending. Um, I think that probably the next closest thing after that, you're talking British GT cars uh, and talking Formula Renault. So they're over £100,000 a year minimum to be racing them type of classes and we're technically around about the same speed. Um, you look at, say for instance, uh, Cadwell Park, we're quicker than British Superbikes around there doing like 123s, 124s around there, they're doing like 126s. So the, the power to weight ratio and the speed aspect and the lap times is phenomenal. For the amount of money and like the budget you're spending through the year, it's absolutely fantastic. Nothing compares to what this class is. Nothing puts as big a smile on my face as this class does. It is the premier class. I've always wanted to do it since when I was younger. It doing nearly 100 mile an hour down the end and straight, an inch off the, off the floor, nothing can describe the buzz. It is, the, it is incredible. Many drivers who drive it will tell you the exact same thing as well. It, it also shows that karting has, is in the right as its own sport. And I think it should be seen like that, not as a stepping stone to move into cars because you look at this class and it is quicker than half the, car, half the car classes out there. I'm pretty sure on some tracks a 250 or a 125 gearbox car has the lap record of the track.